golds and silvers all over the place. And he took a treasure, uh, a silver and gold. And, uh, and he had Parkinson and his hands are shaking. So what use is this now? He put it back. And he kicked it. <laughs> you have to be careful. <laughs> Maybe after you hit it, then you would uh, you would limp because it's too heavy. Because it filled the whole uh, storage and the whole basement. But what? This is a useless thing. And he couldn't even lift his feet. He wanted to kick this money. He wasted his whole life because his life, he was uh, fighting for his money. So his whole life he spent on f uh, for fighting for the, the money. And now he has money all over his storage. And his foot, his leg wanted to kick this money, because, but they were very heavy, so it's not so easy. And maybe he would hurt his leg, and maybe he had osteoporosis, and his leg would break. It's old. So all his life, He's uh, working hard to earn his money and fill his um, bought with it. But what use it is, he said, what use are this now to me? So he knew, empty. In the past it was non-empty. He was grasping over the money. But at the end, he knew it was empty. In the wheel of time, practice this tantra practice of the wheel of time. Because in the process of deterioration, you would uh, be reborn. Moreover, you would understand the ultimate truth of the universe. Once you know the practice of the Wheel of Time, then you would go to the Shambhala Pure Land. You would go to any Pure Land. And once you know the practice of the wheel of time, then, then you have a lot of functions, and all these functions are auspicious, and all calamities will be far from you, and you wouldn't have accomplishments in this world, and also uh, toward enlightenment. So, we are seeking after the beauties and the handsomes, and from the non-emptiness toward emptiness. And those who are seeking for money, it's the same. From the, em from the non-emptiness, emptiness, it would become emptiness. No matter what you are uh, going after, it would go from non-emptiness to emptiness. And then uh, once you understand about the empty nature, then in the wheel of time you would recreate yourself and you would have accomplishment attainments. And in the future, once you have the fruition of the Kala Chakra practice, then you would be able to uh, truly help uh, all the world events.
and the world would become pure land as well. Uh, that's all for the evening, Omani Benihong.